Well, everybody, you have now made it to week 14. Some ways it seems like it's just barely gotten started. Other, way, way, other ways it seems like this has been a long time. Summer, of course, summer term does have an interesting flavor to it. Sometimes it just seems like there's more to do in the summer. And I guess there is. And so, anyway, um, bless you all for doing your best to try and get here to week number 14. Let me give you some helps for the last part. You'll notice that the discussion boards are done. That's it. You don't have to worry about discussion boards this week. Maybe you can have a hallelujah. Maybe it'll be really sad, but you don't have to do that. There is no summary paper this week. Maybe you can get a hallelujah on that one as well. The synthesis project, I'm going to come right back to that in a second. You have end of, end of week reporting. Um, you've got your binder check. Remember to get the form here. Fill out the form and turn the form in. Um, some people got a little confused about that last time, so I don't need an access link or a reminder of where you've shared it in, in Google Drive. I just need this form so you can get your credit. Weekly report, you follow that link and turn it in. And then you get 25 points for doing this uh, post-course knowledge survey. Now the biggest deal today is to get this synthesis project done. So um, here is uh, the synthesis project instructions. Let me see if I can get it come up on my screen. Uh, so here's the final one, 10 to 15 slides. I'll get the highlights here. The title slide must include your name and a clear thesis that defines the problem, question, or NBE issue being discussed. So make sure that that's where it's at the beginning. Use a balanced use of text, images, diagrams. I think you understand that from last time last couple of times. Um, at least one original diagram chart illustrates that demonstrates synthesis. So I would just write this. I would put this in the corner, top corner and say original diagram, um, title slide, um, thesis. Keep it simple so I can find it. Sometimes people think that they put it in there, but I'm trying to figure out if that's what they meant. And You don't want your teacher to have to guess, especially at the end of the term when we're trying to get grades done and Everybody get on to their, their summer break. So anyway, title these things. Um, the final slide must have a conclusion with a specific call to action. So I would put conclusion slide, call to action, those items. Message to the world. Um, again, this title. Um, and then these three bullets, um, a testimony what you'd like the world to know, the message of hope that your children of faith provides. So I title this a main message to the world. So put those on those, make sure you've got it that way. And then a summary slide, so what, so what, therefore, why is your message important? Why would someone want to do what you do now that they've heard your message? Again, um, these instructions are wrong. If not, you've already been, you're done late. Um, and you missed it. So anyway, these are due this week. Um, some instructions have them done by the 22nd uh, of the month and I will take them all until the end of next week. So uh, anyway, the sooner the better. Truthfully, I'm going to try really hard to start grading all of your stuff and I'll do it in a hurry for this last week so there won't be much feedback. So I apologize for that so that you can have a clear uh, picture of where your grad grade stands as the week goes along. So I'll be grading last week's stuff and this week's materials as it comes in as best I can so that you can see where you're at. Please check over your, all of your grades. I learn grade book is a little difficult for instructors and sometimes we miss stuff. Sometimes we get phantom assignments that won't post to to your grade. And so let me know if you see some weird stuff. Um, we're trying our best as instructors to make sure that all works right, but um, sometimes there gets to be a little quirk in the works and we can't uh, get around it by except by fudging things at the end. So anyway, let me know. Have a great week. It's, again, uh, this is it. This should be a simple week. You don't have a whole lot to do compared to other weeks. And so get that stuff done, get it turned in early. Again, I will accept stuff until Friday uh, or Saturday the 22nd. Um, and uh, anyway, just uh, let's get her done and, uh, and move forward so I can get your grades posted and life will be able to go on and, and uh, you can have the, a little break. So anyway, have a great week. See ya. Bye.